match number one of day two will be played between Thelong Gym FC and Delhi Football Club. Highlights now with goals galore in action in these highlights section. It all started off with Nikhil Mali, the star of the show, really. Nikhil Mali then set it up for his teammate, but couldn't quite take it. Then Awang took it upon himself and got the penalty, which he would get Thelong Jim back into the match. And then straight from the center, Pekka. It's the bottom corner on the left-hand side with a staggering shot. Then Avang again gave the ball away. Pekka scoring the second goal for himself in the match. Then Telong Jim started their comeback with beautiful moves constructed. As P. Sunep scores the second goal for them. And Suraj Malik trying to score himself got caught. Red-handed on the other end by Merrin's throw. There was a shot from Suraj which turned out to be an assist kind of a shot for the opponent. And then a mix-up between Remruata and Suraj led to that goal. And Kakevi got the lead for Thelong Jim. Then this ball from Avang was absolutely sublime. But what a finish that is from Bapin as well. But still, for me, that was the pass of the match from Avang. Nikhil Mali then decided to turn it up for his team as he set up Rem Ruata. Who bundled the ball home into the top right corner? And then it would be more goals as Nikhil Mali turned it on with a brilliant, brilliant goal. But you'll see that last goal from Nikhil Mali towards the end of that first half. Just look at this for a quick one, two plays it but this was pure class from Nikhil Mali stands the goalkeeper down and chips it over him and then it was a one-sided affair in the second half with P Sunep with that only goal of the half for Thelong Jim and then it was all Delhi FC goal after goal after goal not just the five goals that he scored Nikhil Mali he also set up a lot of assists which we probably need to count down and like I said if there were fantasy points in a match Nikhil Mali would have been a fantasy player's dream Brilliant technique there from Nikhil Mali. And then Fahad Temuri. Every time he came on in the initial stages, he would concede a foul and he would be taken off as Delhi Football Club. Not just Nikhil Mali, but Rem Ruata also getting on the score sheet. Twenty-two goals scored 
in the first match of day two. 45 goals were scored on day one. And that looks threatened already with 22 goals in the first match. If things go well in at this rate, they would match that tally in the second match itself. This is Chantpreet's goal. Nikhil Mali then assisted Nal again. Then Nal moving forward again. Fahad Temuri's pass. Find Sangha who got it for his first goal. And with that, the stats are, as you can see on your screen, with 45% ball possession to 55 of Delhi. 50 shots, a half century of shots for Delhi. 31 on target. 9 corners to 12 of Telong Gems. 6 fouls to 12 for Delhi. And 1 yellow card each. Eleven shots taken by Kakevi, Bapin with five, five for Alume, Sunep, and Avang with four shots each, and Saku with two. Fifty shots for Delhi FC, Nikhil Mali. The staggering 15 of which he scored 5. Pekka with 7. Couldn't get his hat-trick. Scored 2. Null with 2 out of 6. Koyari with 2 out of 4. Jojo with 1 out of 4. And Sangha 1 out of 3. And that is it from the first match. Star of the show, Nikhil Mali. Telong Jem lose this match with the deficit of 10 goals. 6 goals to 16. Delhi FC run out triumphant in the first match.